Hello, welcome to Shadows of Judgment with me, that mouthy chick. Missed y'all. Why? I just did fire and water. We got air and earth left, so we're gonna see who comes up next, right? No, we did fire. Earth signs, you're up next. Virgo, Capricorn, and Taurus. This is for y'all in the sun position of Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Mars. Please check your charts accordingly. If it resonates, kill. If not, just don't worry about it because nobody cares. Anyway, um, if you want a personal reading, it's the, all the info's in the description box below. You want to be a member of the Watch All the Extendeds for the Zodiacs? You can join. Click on the Shadow Works ones. Don't click on the Extended one. I'm, I'm nixing that one. Everything's just going to be on the Shadow Works. It's easier that way. Right? Anyway. Taurus, you're up first for your shadow. Yes, you are. So, let's see what's going on for your week. This is for today, the 28th, to next Saturday. Because I don't know the date for next Saturday, but if I say next Saturday, it makes more sense. I actually almost forgot. I actually started on the um, March readings. And then it was just like, what day is it today? Friday? Oh, it's Saturday. I gotta do this shit again. <laughs> All right, Taurus, you're trying to get overburdened or you're overburdened? One of the two. I think you're trying to end the shit. I think you're ending the shit. You're just like, nope. That's actually what I got for your reading, <laughs> surprisingly. You were basically doing this same shit in your uh, monthly read that I'm picking up for you right here. So it's about the same shit. But yeah, I think you're ending the burden right here, right? You don't know where to go, possibly with the cancer. Doesn't seem time's moving anytime soon. You want this death so, you know, you can get out of the cold, possibly leave like Beller McDingleson in the ditch somewhere since he's so useless, right? Um, you don't know where to go, but you also could be hanging on to that shit a little bit too harder than what you need to be. Balance is needed here. I don't think you know what to do because, like, you're kind of hanging on to your shit, too. Or a cancer could be hanging on to your shit. Something like that. But it's, like, not very many pentacles. Except for this bitch right here. But that just takes it to, like, the four of pentacles. Which is over here. Yeah, it, there's not going to be anything on the side. You're trying to sustain yourself, Taurus and Cross Watchers. Yeah, you're hanging on to your shit so in order to end the third party. You're just like, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Fuck this noise. You got the devil right there, man. Like, look at that shit. All right, check it, Taurus, right? You're burdened by this shit. You're trying to come to an end of it, but it doesn't seem to be working because you're not getting anything back. You know? Like, this other person over here, they ain't even getting shit. You're literally dropping the coins back in this dude's hand. How fucked is that? He's, like, the person who's supposed to be paying you shit. And yet, you're paying him, like, his rent and everything. Like, you look homeless. You look like you can barely afford your rent. And then they want you to pay out of pocket for them. It's probably why you're ending the relationship anyway. Because I really feel like you're trying to get away from somebody. Especially someone who doesn't really assist or help. You're not sure where to go forward to and you're just hanging on to shit hoping like, I really hope, I really hope we break the fuck up. I've been there. I know. I've been there. Over here, I think you are ending things so you just get yourself settled again. But it's still the four of pentacles just like over here. You're still hanging on. Which I can't blame for you, Taurus. But that's what's your week's coming up for you. <coughs> I'm going to have to be dealing with some horse shit. Sad ass day. Where we go. It's your turn. So, Virgo. Let's see what your week has for you, huh? A mad ass empress? Okay. Someone's bitter. Someone's bitter. There might be a split up somewhere. Mmm. So there's three people here. The one who's building this shit is the one who's the bitter empress, right? The other two people aren't even getting the fuck along anymore, Virgo and Cross Watchers. 
interesting. Yeah, you might have split up from these people. They might have split up from you. One singular person split up from somebody. Time seems to have stopped for this empress. Yeah, like you see split up to go to calmer waters. And there was some injustice with how all this shit was working and playing out, it seems like. Like some wish fulfillment here somewhere. Hmm. King of Wands. So someone's dealing with a fire sign. Could definitely be Aries, also Taurus, or Libra. Libra's out here too. Death card. In order to end things, huh? Hmm. Well, someone was expecting a vic to look like a victor here for your own cross watchers. This Empress here, she's pretty bitter. And it seems like things have halted. Possibly with the King of Wands right here. Something isn't starting. And it, not healing. Not um, communication. People were working together. But something happened with this, with the Justice card reverse. Like, I guess them all working together just wasn't supposed to be. It definitely didn't heal any situations or bring anything here. All it caused was a lack of communication. It seems like this King of Wands right here, um, he's kind of ignoring trying to start the conversation to begin with. Over yonder, though, like these two, whoever they were in this th in this three party situation where everyone was supposed to work together, apparently they've all split up, going to calmer waters. I think separating in order to end things. Hmm. Interesting. That was yours, Virgo. Just looking over yours, like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Now, like, the tarot tired. It's kidding me. Mm. <clears throat> Let's let to see. Capricorn, it's your turn. Let's see what your week has. Uh,. Someone is lacking intuition here, not paying attention to their intuition, and things might not be working with everybody in the middle. Like, there are three people here, and none of them are listening or working together, you know? Someone needs a break from that shit, and someone isn't listening to their intuition because they probably manifested some shit, or something didn't work for them, right? People aren't working together, so people probably want to move away from it. A person wants a break because their mind is wrecked. There is some justice involved with someone not listening to their intuition and acting out and shit. Hmm. People are disagreeing. It seems like someone's venturing to leave, but they also want to stick around, too. Yeah, someone's hung up on their crossroad right here. Caps and cross watchers. Oh, there he is. And there's the sun, Leo. Hmm. Caps and cross watchers, do you feel lonely? Is it is, is that why she's looking all mel melancholy and shit? She's all lonely because there's happiness over here. Um, it's like someone isn't using her intuition to real. I. I, I like, I feel like you're blaming yourself for something a little bit, Caps and Cross Watchers, too. Um, like, you're blaming yourself, possibly, for being alone. You're blaming yourself for how maybe things have went down, possibly. Um, even though over yonder, people may not be getting along and talking about, I'm leaving, they still want to come back. You know, bring some happiness. It's just everybody's, like, needing a break. Someone's, like, boo-hooing in their bedroom because they don't know what the fuck they're doing. Really. Oh, that's for the most part. But I feel like, like, I don't know. Is someone contradicting themselves with you? Or are you contradicting yourself with them, Caps and Cross Watchers? Like, that's the real question. I don't know. My ex-girlfriend was like that, man. She'd say one thing and do the absolute opposite. It'd be like, oh my god, like, just shut the fuck up. <laughs> what can I give you for the rest of the fucking week?
Uh, it completed. Oh, okay. Oof. Someone is rough. Someone's very rough, Caps and Cross Watchers. Mm, I feel like someone is like expecting payment or some shit, right? Like there's a total like about like someone is paying the wrong person their dues while ignoring another. Uh, also while keeping mouths shut, um, going into battle, coming out saying, I don't love you, and then it's like that's how the cycle pretty much completes this week. It's like um I don't know. It's like backwards land. A lot of emotional manipulation and stuff. There's still a door open here. Someone sad. Ah. Oh, she's all pissed because someone like ended up like wishing for something that I don't think she was aware of. Could be a fire sign, Sagittarius, you know, Aries for sure. Um, yeah, someone's a little bit nettled. And I think someone's doing something wrong. Someone's very much vocal about what the right thing to do is, but despite that, like, it's still, some, a cup's not being given. Someone's, like, shutting up in order to end how the cycle goes. So, um, that's pretty much your week, Earth Sign. So, if you enjoyed this, like, share, subscribe. You got to if you don't want to, but thank you for watching my video regardless. Uh, remember, love y'all's faces, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.